Welcome to the second instalment of Number Hub's How Big is a Trillion? Today on Number Hub, I'm going to give you some practical financial advice. Imagine you owe someone a trillion dollars. Though the currency is not important, you can imagine it in any standard currency you want. So pounds, euros, dollars, any of the world currencies. Zimbabwean dollars, galactic credits, Bitcoin, any of the made up currencies, whatever it is, this is my advice for paying back a trillion standard units of currency. So you go to the person that you owe this amazing amount of money to and you say, I tell you what, I'll pay it back to you and I'll pay it all, but I'm going to pay it back gradually. I'll do it in installments. I will give you one unit every second. So you start paying back a one dollar or one euro or one credit, whatever it is, one a second. And gradually you'll pay off your debt of one trillion. In fact, after only 60 seconds, you will have paid back 60 units of debt. After an hour, you'll have paid back 3,600. After a day, you'll have paid back 86,400. Not bad progress for just one day. In fact, you'll hit the million mark after only 11 days, 13 hours, 46 minutes, and 40 seconds. We can't be that far off. People always think that a million is a lot of money, a billion is just a bit more, and a trillion is just a bit more again. We'll be there in no time. In fact, you will cross the billion mark after only 31 years, 261 days, 13 hours, 21 minutes, and 28 seconds. It took a bit longer than expected. In fact, you won't pay off the entire trillion until you've been handing over one standard unit of currency every second for 31,688 years, 269 days, 17 hours, 37 minutes, and 4 seconds. It's a phenomenal amount of time. People forget that a trillion is a thousand times bigger than a billion, and a billion is a thousand times bigger than a million. This is why, if it takes 31 years to hit a billion, it's going to take 31 thousand years and a bit to hit a trillion. In fact, if you want to go all the way to a quadrillion, that's a thousand times bigger again. That would take you 31,688,738 years. 185 days, 2 hours, 37 minutes, and 4 seconds. A phenomenal amount of time. But how is this practical advice? Well, the great thing is, you're never going to pay that all off. You're going to die well before that. In fact, as of, well, the most recent stats I could get were the end of 2012. In the UK, the modal age of death for males was 85 years. Women, 89 years. This means that the most common age to die for men in the UK, as I speak, is 2,682,000,000 seconds. For women, that's 2,806,000,000 seconds. So you're never going to have to pay off more than that. In fact, if your debt is 3 billion standard units or more, even if you emerge from the womb already with that debt, if you can somehow convince them to let you pay it off one unit per second, even though that sounds impressive, you'll never have to pay it all off. And that is my practical financial advice. Oh.